How's it going everyone, Electro Pikachu here, and welcome back to Pokemon Sword. Last time, we caught Critius, our Galarian Farfetch'd, who will be a permanent member on the team. And this time we're going to head on over to Holbury so we can get our second badge. Alright. Let's actually use the bike because it'll be a lot quicker. I believe we still have that battle with Hop to take care of. Yep. Um. Actually, let's keep Critius in the front. Just because of the fact that Critias, if he gets three critical hits, will evolve. Now, we don't have any moves that will increase our critical hit rate a lot. If, we di if I did, this would be a lot simpler. But we'll just use Fury Cutter. Growl, go ahead. I'll just keep Critias out front. Because all I need is three critical hits. It doesn't matter how I get them. Okay, I still haven't gotten a crit, though. Uh, we'll just... Go for another Fury Cutter. That's all we can do. Come on. Okay, that's one. Alright, Galahand. Oh, once learned taunt. No. We don't need taunt. Corvus Squire could be a bit of a problem. To fight, but let's see, brutal swing, fury attack. Okay, we'll be fine. Shouldn't do too much to Critias. Or brutal swing. That's another critical hit. We just need one more. Heck, okay, don't KO. All right, we're good. Alright, just one more critical hit, and then you can evolve. Yes! Gradius is evolving after this. Pluck. Okay, that KOs, but the evolution should still happen, I believe. So, let's send out Ace. You can just headbutt to finish up here. Clock. Strong, but it won't matter. Four Squire down. Level 19. While well, Shock Six level 14. And he's got a Rab Boot. Only fitting that we use Austin Showers. Every one of my Pokemon is an ace. This is no problem at all. Honestly, I like that about actual teams, like in the Pokemon anime. If it's not just like there's one specific Pokemon that's extremely strong. If it's more like each one of them is equally just as strong as the other. Crit of our own, okay. Took out. Austin, guess Austin Showers just wanted to show up Critias. I mean, Critias is evolving, so. What? 
I got the three critical hits. Don't tell me I have to stay alive for it. Because that hasn't happened with... I've had Pokemon faint and still evolve. <sighs> Alright, Critias. I guess we'll just have to... Find a battle for you to get three crits in. Resist Feather, okay. We'll fight this Aldegoss. Hopefully we can get a... We can get three crits off of it, and if not... Uh, I mean, we could fight Wobbuffet, I guess? Sing. That could have been annoying. Good grief. Cotton spores fine. Critias immediately woke up, alright. Not another it's not a crit. Another cotton spore. Come on. I need three crits for you to evolve. There's one. From the looks of it, a crit won't knock it out, so... Come on. Dang it. Alright, at least you dodged the Razor Leaf. Alright. You know what? Let's go out to the wild area. If we can see if there is any TMs that I can get. Well, TRs, I guess. Like Night Slash or Leaf Blade. Night Slash and Leaf Blade are the two main ones that I'd be needing. Uproar, Close Combat, Sludge Wave, and Low Kick. Okay. Um. Need as many watts as we can get for these. Ah! <laughs> Stupid Bunnelby. Let's get out of here. There should be a guy up here. Surf, Megahorn, Iron Defense, Leaf Storm, and Swords Dance. Swords Dance we should keep in mind, because if I can get a good move like that, then that'll be great. So my phone had gotten a little too hot, so I was letting it cool down. And as I was looking around trying to find a guy who had the Leaf Blade TR, I ended up KOing a very strong Zigzagoon, and now Ace is evolving.
What do you know? <laughs> I now have Galarian Linoon. And wants to learn Night Slash. Yeah, uh... No more Snarl. Night Slash is a lot better. One thing I did end up finding off camera was the TR for Focus Energy, which will definitely come in handy. I was not able to find Leaf Blade or anything of the sort, but this will be just fine. As long as I can get into a battle with something that can take three critical hits. Actually, you know what? I think I know something that can. On the route we were using to get to Root to Holberry, there was a specific Pokemon that's known for being annoyingly high in defense and special defense. Let's just heal up first before we take that on. Ah, eventually the four main members of our team will be able, will be at least evolved once. Wedge her station, yeah, we'll go take care of that at some point. Alright, here we are on Route 5. Not one up here, but if we go down here. Let's see. Nope. Nowhere in sight so far. I do believe occasionally you can see it in rustling grass. So, let's see if we can find it. No, that's an Esper. Although it might be able to take a few rock smashes. But then again, it's also super effective against us, so we might not want to take any chances. Okay, we got a critical hit on the Esper. Ooh! Applin! Yeah, we still have Kapora in the... Party, you know what? Let's check a great ball at this app one. Alright. We'll have this thing sitting around for a while. We'll call it... How about Fritter? We'll put it on the team. Get rid of Kapora. Probably won't use the Applin- Oh, there it is. Wobbuffet. That's what I was looking for. It can take some Rock Smash critical hits, and then it can't really do too much against us, unless it has Counter. I mean, I guess it could Destiny Bond. That might be a problem. Safeguard, okay. Wait, what does Safeguard do again? Not very effective, but a critical hit. 
All right, it doesn't protect it from critical hits. That's the important thing here. Another critical hit. And a defense lower. That's important. Destiny Bond. Okay. Well, simply all we gotta do is we Rock Smash again. We won't KO it. And then it can't use Destiny Bond a, third, a second time in a row. It can counter. That's where we have a problem here. Uh, but Brutal Swing... We'll take care of it. And it was another critical hit, just in case. Galhand and Austin Showers both level 23. Not bad. And just like that, Critius evolves into Surfetch. Believe, yep. Iron Defense. We'll take it. Let's actually get rid of Fury Cutter. I wasn't really using it anyways. Kind of want to keep Focus Energy around because we could set up with it and then get a bunch of critical hits. So we'll keep it around for now. Alright, now let's start heading onwards. Right after we fight this person. Breeder Debra. Got a Minchino. Which is nothing compared to our newly evolved Critias. Single Rock Smash. It's gone. Steeny? Doesn't matter. Brutal swing. It survived, and that was a crit, too. What the heck? Rapid spin doesn't do much. Let's brutal swing again. Oh. Potion. I mean, that won't heal it up all... Yeah, that won't heal it up all the way, but okay. Critias level 22, Shoxic level 18. Another breeder. Oh well. No, don't make me. Don't make me a brutal swing. That did nothing. <laughs> oh no. Stuffle. Stuffle, no. Stuffle, no. Stuffle, no. Bye bye, Stuffle. This cry was so sad. A Ralts, okay. Could end up being a Glade, that would be cool. If they actually, like, were able to be rematched, but that Ralts is gone now, we'll never see it again. You have another... Cutie Fly. Prettiest, just get rid of it. Okay, I know those 
four times not very effective, but the critical hit. So what if my evasiveness <laughs> lowered? I'm faster than you. Critius is good. Critius is a strong duck. Let's get going. Oh yeah, there is an item over here. But I don't think it's anything good. However, here we are. Holberry. Let's go inside the Pokemon Center and heal up. And I'm also going to call it an episode here. We made it to our destination. Next time we're going to take on the gym. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!